raise your drinks up casually. Raise your drinks, raise your drinks up, raise your drinks up casually. It's the Black Bourbon Family. Hey everyone, I'm Jason. And I'm Brandy. And we're the Black, Black Bourbon, Bourbon Family. family. We have the OG Brandy. Everyone, we have the original toasted barrel bourbon. We have the limited edition, limited release Michter's US1 toasted barrel finish. So 10 years ago, Michter's said, we need to do something different. We need to release a bourbon that hasn't been done yet. So they said, we are going to do a toasted barrel bourbon. Okay? Okay. All right. All right. And they decided that they were going to take their US-1 bourbon, and then they were going to take a separate barrel because, you know, they put the U.S. one bourbon in a barrel, mature it over their propri proprietary, couldn't even get the word out, <laughs> proprietary aging, right? Okay. And then they said, we're going to take an 18-month-old air-dried wood barrel and put the bourbon in there. Okay? Okay. Now, this barrel has been toasted to precise specifications but it's not charred okay so it's toasted but not charred and they did this 10 years ago and every other year or so i believe if i'm not mistaken this is the fifth edition i can double check that and uh, if i'm wrong i'll put the correct edition on the screen <laughs> but I believe this is like the fourth or fifth edition now I'm changing I'm heading now. <laughs> give uh, me yourself some wiggle room right. <laughs> <laughs> um, of this bourbon so I think we need to check it out Brandy now the proof I'm just going to look on it because I couldn't remember Okay. do you remember? I don't Okay. the proof is coming in at 91.4. So I believe that's the same proof as their bourbon. Okay. And then MSRP is around $110. So it's not expensive. Or it's not expensive. It's not inexpensive, but they've gone through a process to get this to what it is right now. All right, Brandy. All right. Brandy's like, all right, let's get to it. And we got our Michter's uh, mini. I don't even know what you would call these. They're not Glen Cairns, but they're many. They're smaller glasses, but Michter's on them. Uh, but yeah. All right, bro. All right. Okay. You sure they're not many Glen Cairns? Uh, I mean, they have the little shape at the top. Maybe they are. I don't know. I don't know. But they're cute. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good. It does smell good. What you getting on the nose? I'm getting like some some honey or some some it's real sweet. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I get honey. I get honey, honey too. Mm-hmm. It's really, really sweet smelling. Um <laughs> I mean of course I'm getting my spice. Right. <laughs> Brandy is getting her spice <laughs> at 91.4. But I agree, though. Yeah. I do. I agree. But what, what are you getting? So I'm getting the honey, but I'm also getting like... Um, so now when you say spice, you kind of influence my, what I was going to say. I'm getting like a small like black... I don't know if it's black pepper. It may be mm. cinnamon. But on the nose, it's more like a black pepper. Because you do get a little spice. 91 proof, you would think that you wouldn't, right? Or but not I'm as also much. Also, smell a little bit of cinnamon. Too. Are you? Like, you know how sometimes people say something and it's like, oh, that's, that's what cinnamon. I just said. That's exactly. That's crazy. And if you all could do us a favor, let us know: Have you had this edition or any of the previous 
um, Toasted Barrel Editions, and what were your thoughts on it? And if you could do us a favor, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and follow us on Instagram. All right, you ready to, ooh, I just got something else. What'd you get? Um, I don't know. Let me get back to you. It was something different, but I don't know what it is. <laughs> Cheers. Mmm. <laughs> nice legs. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Okay, Brandy. Mmm. What's your first thoughts? Oh, um, she going in for one more. I'll wait for you. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you all right now. I'll just say this and I'll let you give your notes. This does not drink 91.4. No. Right? Right. No, it doesn't. It does not. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'll let you start. Well, mm -hmm. for me, mm -hmm. it starts a little... Not dry, but a little dry, but then it hits you in the middle with a little sweetness. Mm -hmm. And then it hits you at the back <laughs> with the spice. <laughs> 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 so it's like I'm getting uh, like some uh, some complexity going on mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. um, it's good. It's not overly sweet. Mm -hmm. Like you smell the sweetness, mm -hmm. but then when you drink it, it's not overly like you know, sweet, mm -hmm. but, um, I don't know. That's, that's what I'm, I'm getting right now, but what you got? So I feel like that honey that we were talking about, mm -hmm. I get that. I also get some butterscotch in there too. Um, very slightly. Yeah. Not overpowering. It's not overpowering. Mm -hmm. Not at all. I get more honey than anything. So I'm going to tell you with this, <laughs> as I was drinking it, and I was thinking about it. I was like, this actually reminds me of something. This reminds me, and it's almost like, maybe we'll come back and do this comparison. Okay. This almost reminds me of Shanks. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And I can't remember the specifications on Shanks. I know they do something different every year with the wood and things like that. Mm -hmm. Um... I don't get, cause I'm, when it comes for me, when it comes to toasted, I'm hit or miss with toasted. Yeah. Some toasted, I'm like, this is good. Some toasted, I'm like, eh, it's okay. This one, I'm really enjoying. Um, But I'm getting that honey. I get that spice on the end. The, Do you think it's cinnamon or do you think it's like a black pepper spice? I think it's cinnamon. Mm, mm-hmm. I'm, I'm getting a little bit more cinnamon me. <laughs> because is it more like a sweeter, not sweeter, but it's a mild spice, if that makes any sense. It's not a punch you in the... No, it's not like, oh, I need to grab some water, right, you know, real quick. Right. I mean, I'm, I'm still drinking it, but mm -hmm. I'm still getting that spice, but it's not like taking over yeah it's not taking over yeah but you can definitely <laughs> <laughs> you can feel it you can feel it yeah. but it it's yeah i think i think anyone could probably drink this um especially if they're new to bourbon mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. this will be good mm -hmm. but it, it has a little bit more spice than it, that it 91. Has a little bit more spice, so. <laughs> I but know. I know what you mean, though. I know what you mean. Okay, maybe you your mean. second, you know. <laughs> <laughs> maybe not your first, but maybe, yeah. But it's, you know, mixed is always, you know, they have the lower proof, but they are, that spice is still there. Mm -hmm. And so what they do is they have a lower entry, uh, barrel entry proof, right? Mm -hmm. So a lot of companies, they enter it in at the 125. I think Michter's, uh enters their bourbon in at 103 proof. Okay. But what it does is it allows them to where they don't have to add a bunch of water to dilute it, right? So it's not barrel proof, right? I mean, they are bringing it down, but it's still not like overly, um, like, uh, I can't think of the word, but just a lot of water in to bring it down or whatever. It. Diluting mm -hmm. it. Yeah, exactly. 
So that allows for the spice to still be there, even at this lower proof. Yeah. It's time, y'all. Cheers, y'all. This is very good. Um, initially, I was like, really? 91 proof toasted? <sighs> this almost is like, an, I would say between 97, between 95 and 100. I'm not going to try to go in the middle and all that stuff. <laughs> I would say between 95 and 100 proof, this is what it tastes like. Mm -hmm. Good? Good? Yeah. All right. Maybe we'll come back with the shanks in this to see how close they are. All right? Okay. All right. <laughs> All right, everyone. Um, well, the Michter's 10-year anniversary. This is their 10-year anniversary. The OG. I call it the Michter's OG in the toasted world. Um, it is very, very good. Would highly recommend uh, if you see it in the store at a reasonable price, pick it up. Well, we thank you for joining us today. As mentioned earlier, if you could give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, follow us on Instagram, and we will talk to you next time. Cheers. <laughs>